Yeah, hello guys and welcome to my new video. Today I want to show you how to install mods for Minecraft 1.6 plus. So that means this tutorial will also work on the new upcoming versions like 1.6.3 and something. And what you need for this is just a new Minecraft, um, Winra and the mod you want to install. I have here the Optifine mod and I will also post the links in the description for X-Ray, Optifine and something but please note Optifine is not released yet for 1.6.2 so um, it will be released today or maybe in the next days so please be patient but if, it, if the release comes out you can do um, you can install it with the help of this tutorial here and I will show you now how to install this so just go to start here and type percent app data percent now it should open up this folder here and you just search for dot minecraft and now you open this then you go to versions open this too and now you should see the latest version here always pick the latest version um, here the latest version is 1.6.2 so open this and now you should see two files in there so just right click um, mark them and right click and copy them now you can go back and create a new folder here which is called the same but on the end add the name of the mod you want to install so I will add Optifine here and now we will go in the folder here and right click and paste the files we just have copied and we will also rename those files to the same name like the folder so right click them and go to rename and add Optifine do this also for the JSON file here. Optifine. Okay, now you need to open the JSON file here with right click and go to open with and then search for notepad. On Windows 8 you can go to more options and scroll down and you should somewhere see notepad and use this. Then it opens up with notepad and you should see some signs here. But the only thing we want to add it is the ID here, because the ID is 1.6.2 and we changed this to 1.6.2 Optifine, so we need to change this hit here too. So just add Optifine and hit File and Save and then you can close this. And now we need to insert the modded files into the jar here. To do this you just go to right click on the Optifine jar here and go to Open With and then go to WinRA. Now you can see the files in the jar here and then open the zip file from the modded files here and just um, mark all the files here with Control A and drag and drop it them into the other jar. Okay, so now it's in the 1.6.2 Optifine jar. There should be all the Optifine files in there and what we need to do next is delete the meta in folder because this causes black screens, errors and crashes. So just go there and delete this and press yes. And now you're done with the modding. So you can just close this here, no need to save, just go to X. And now we can start Minecraft. So as you can see on the, on the right here it should say some version and here the latest version and it should say 1.6.2 Optifine so to edit this we need to go to edit profile and here on use version click here and choose release 1.6.2 Optifine and go to save profile now you can see it will use the version and the release 1.6.2 Optifine to, to play um, and when you start this with play here, you start the modded jar. But if you don't want to play with the mods anymore, you just go back there to edit profile and use the release version 1.6.2 without mods. So you can play without mods if you do this. And if you want to do to play with mods, then just go to release 1.6.2 Optifine. And then just go to play and you're fine. Um, if you want to insert more mods in one jar, you can do this too. Just copy more mods into the jar and rename it to I don't know what you need. And you can also um, do this for several mods. You can add an X-ray an X-ray release here or other releases. So as you want to, 
and just um, go to the menu here and choose the one you want to play with and you're done. So this was my tutorial on how to install mods on the new Minecraft and I will keep the links in the description updated for Optifine and X-Ray and some other mods. And please also check out my next video, it will be on how to install a hack client for the new Minecraft. So there are more features included and thanks for watching and see you the next time. Bye.